Hey everyone, welcome back to It's Tech Time. Today we're diving into the world of Tails Operating System. It is a privacy-focused operating system designed to protect your online anonymity. I will show you how to download the Tails operating system to a USB and boot your computer to that USB to access the Tor network. Plus, we'll cover how to set up persistent storage to save your files and settings between sessions. Tails is a portable operating system that can work off a USB drive. So benefits of using Tails is privacy. Tails and Tor help to protect your privacy online by anonymizing your traffic and preventing your ISP from tracking your activity. Tails is a secure operating system that operates from your RAM and protects your computer from malware and other online threats. And as soon as your computer is shut down, every trace of what you did in the Tails operating system is deleted. Tails and Tor can help you bypass censorship and access blocked websites. And using Tails is as simple as having a USB and a computer that can boot from USB. And I'm going to walk through those steps with you. First, we're going to download Tails from their official website. I'll put a link to their website in the video description down below. I'm going to be using Tails on a Windows operating system, so I'm going to click to download from Windows. And it will tell you the requirements from for Tails on this screen here. Like I said, you need a USB stick, and since I'm using Windows, I'm going to need Windows 7 or later. And the computer I'm going to use it on needs at least 2 gigabytes of RAM. So following the official steps, I'll download Tails. Once you finish downloading, you can verify your download and make sure it's safe and nothing is corrupted. Click select your download, go to the folder where you downloaded it at, click open, and it's going to verify that it's the correct image and that nothing's corrupted during the download. And when it's finished, you should see a verification successful in a green chip. Now next, you need to download a USB installer to write the downloaded Tails ISO image to a bootable USB. Now Tails recommends Bella Etcher, and there are other free options out there that you may use, but we're going to walk through Bella Etcher since Tails, rec since Tails recommends it on their webpage. So we'll click download Bella Etcher for Windows, save. If you haven't already, go ahead and plug in your USB to your machine. Once Bella Etcher is finished downloading, you'll see this screen here. We're going to click flash from file and then navigate to the Tails ISO image that we downloaded and click open. Next, we're going to click select target and then we're going to navigate to the USB drive that you that you should have plugged in at this time. And we're going to click select. Now it's as simple as clicking flash. Etcher will now flash your USB drive with the Tails ISO image you selected, which should only take a few minutes. When it's successfully finished, you'll be met with a screen that says flash completed. And so now we will close this window. And I removed the USB and now I'm going to go get a secondary laptop that I have. And I'm going to boot that laptop to this USB to show you what it looks like. So I booted this, this Dell laptop to USB by pressing F12. Now I'll select the USB of Tails on it. So the first thing you'll see after booting to the USB with Tails on it is this welcome to Tails message. And you can click start Tails. And it instantly brings you up to connecting to Tor. And we're going to connect to Tor automatically and then click connect. When Tor successfully connects, you'll be greeted with the Tails homepage. Now, if you want to create persistent storage, you'll click on applications, persistent storage, and an information screen will come up telling you that everything you do disappears automatically when you shut down Tails, but you can save some of your files and configurations in an encrypted persistent storage on your Tails USB stick. And it gives some examples like Wi-Fi passwords, browser bookmarks. With the Tails operating system in Tor, you can browse the internet anonymously protecting your privacy and security. Always follow safe online practices and avoiding and avoid accessing sensitive information using the Tails operating system. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to share it with anyone who might benefit from learning about online privacy. If you have any questions, you can message me through our community Discord server, which will be linked below. Thank you for watching and as always, stay curious, stay secure, and see you in the following video.